First, I'm going to say, go to Memology101's channel. He's covering this way better than I ever will. Majority of my information actually comes from the kill stream that he was on and his videos. But for people who don't follow him but follow me, go to him. He covers this way better. But is this the fall of Phil DeFranco? Will this be what ends the Philly D show? He is working with a company called BetterHelp. That's a scam. They are straight up taking your money and then not offering you the services they promise. You agree to the TOS. You pay your money. And they're supposed to, all right, you're going to be connected with this counselor. All right, 3 o'clock, I'm going to meet my counselor online. And the counselor doesn't show up. And you can't get a refund. All these mid-range or larger YouTubers, oh, yeah, I use a service. It's a great service. Here's the thing. What that one's suspecting is, hi, Boogie. Hi, Philly D. Hi, other YouTuber. Here's your own personal connection to your counselor. You say, hey, counselor, I need to talk. They will talk to you. Hey, counselor, make sure you're always on the line for this guy. He's going to be promoting us. But when you're not a mid-range to big YouTuber who's getting paid to promote better help, you sign up. Oh, it's $35 a week. No, no, no. It's $35 a week if you pay for the full year up front. It's like $68 a week if you only pay for a month. It's yeah, something like that. How the prices work out. It's, just, it's a lot of money. Is it less than going to an actual therapist if you don't have insurance? Yes. But when you go to an actual therapist, you make an appointment. They're there. They are there. You go to better help, you pay all that money, and they're not there. But 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 I paid sixty eight dollars a week for the for the month, and then the entire month I never actually got to talk to a counselor, and I can't get my money back. And even better, let's say you actually do get a hold of a counselor. Better help then sells that conversation. Better help takes that conversation and sells it. Which, how that is not a breach of patient, doctor, confidentiality, whatever. I don't, I don't understand how that's not a breach of that. How that's not a violation of the law. That they can take your conversations and then sell them. It's just... And now, let's say you're, you're depressed. You're actually suffering from it. You need help. You, get a, you actually do get a hold of one of these better help counselors. It's like, wow, that sucks, dude. Now that I can do it for you. You need medication. You need whatever to balance out the serotonin that's not being produced or whatever. They can't do that. It's like, all right, well, that was $68 a week for a month wasted. Now I don't have the money to go to a real counselor to get the medication that I need. That It's a scam. An even bigger one for Philip DeFranco, Rogue Rocket. That's his company. It's attached to, like, Boogie and all that. It's part of Philly D's company. So Philly DeFranco was part of BetterHelp or promoting them well before he said he was. And I like how, oh, yeah, I'm going to be sending a reporter down to ask some questions. Really, Phil DeFranco? Really? You're going to be defending them. We know you're going to be defending them. So, you send a reporter down, it's going to be, all right, do a fluff piece, ask them the questions that they already have pre-screened, that they already have the answers for, don't ask anything else, and if you do, I'm not going to report it anyways. Philip DeFranco, he, he, he sold out his integrity, he sold out his honesty for money. How much? We don't know. It could be a lot of money, though. The money this company was making... Like, oh, the first month, the YouTuber gets 200 BetterHelp gets 40 But if the person stays on for two months, well, then that 240 bucks that they were paying a month, huh, the second month, that entire $240 goes to BetterHelp. You get 10,000 people who go two months. Well, golly gee, Wilker, that's a ton of money. That is an insane amount of money. That's $2.4 million. Wait. 
right? Yeah, $2.4 million should be. I'm doing the math right. It's 3 o'clock in the morning. I'm a little tired, but I was just watching part 10. Like, I've been watching them. Just got done watching part 10. I'm like, God fucking damn it. This is just, this is bigger than YouTube. This is people's mental health at stake. I'm going to have the link to Memeology's channel, to some of the videos. Like, you guys have to watch. These are masterpieces. These are fantastic. Fantastic. So yes, I really think that if this is not the downfall for Phil DeFranco, he definitely banged a leprechaun. Like you cannot be scamming people out of money over their mental health in today's day and age. A hundred years ago, oh you have mental health issues, here's some cocaine, you got ghosts in your blood. Alright, but today, no. Suicide. Murder suicides, going on rampages, drowning your kids in the bathtub. People have mental health issues, and they want help. They need help. A lot of them don't have the money to go see a professional. Oh, there's a way for me to you know, be on my phone. Like, oh, man, I might have time from here to there, but that's going to be after hours for any professional. Oh, better help? I can just meet up my with my counselor online or through my phone? At 8 o'clock at night? Wow, and it's cheaper than seeing a professional? This is perfect. Sign up, pay all that money, and then... Counselor doesn't show up. Well, maybe maybe, maybe tomorrow they will. Doesn't show up. Three days later. Oh, they finally showed up, and they don't care. They just told me the same psycho babble that I can get from any book on depression. They don't actually offer me any help. Now I'm out all that money. I've been dealing with the stress of trying to get a hold of them for the past four days. Finally do, and they don't actually help me. Then they snap. They kill themselves. They kill someone else. They kill someone else and themselves. Like, mental health is no joke. You do not mess with someone's mental health, people. And yet, that's exactly what Philip DeFranco and BetterHelp is doing. Do not use them. They are a scam. Watch Mimology 101's videos to find out more. God. Anyways, guys, I'm not going to use my tag like this. Mental health, this scam is just too important to be doing stuff like that. So, yes, guys, click out the links below for Memeology 101. Watch his videos. They are amazing.